Well, good morning, everybody. Happy Christmas. It's December the 28th. And it's time to start on this engine bay. So I'll be changing a lot of stuff on here for carbon. <clears throat> it's taken me so long because I had to wait 12 weeks for the carbon parts to be made by Fiberworks. Took a little bit longer than expected, but um, they turned out really nice to be fair. So a lot's gonna be changing, changing these, carbon, changing the color there, carbon, carbon, carbon intake, carbon. Where's the camera going? Um, yeah, so, and a lot of black parts, unless I wanna spray these black. A lot of black bolts um, <clears throat> and I've actually got a T valve mod to do as well so that's the third thing I'm gonna do which is right behind here it looks a bit tight so yeah back to it right so I took all the plastic surrounds off uh, it was tight to get under there in the end you just couldn't get under so I took the plastics off take the windscreen wipers off plastic comes off pretty easy to be fair then there's that metal plate there then which is held on by four 10 mil bolts just undone that and that uh, right gopro battery died i don't know where i was but um yeah metal bits off oh, so we have better access now and that white thing there that's the uh t-valve oh yeah which uh looks straightforward actually fingers crossed so the T-valve is off, that is it there. It was tricky. That piece there goes round the back and onto the plastic manifold here and is surrounded at the bottom of here where the clip is by a plastic shroud. And you've got to be careful in case the nipple snaps. So uh, I couldn't access the clip. It took me about half hour just to try and get it off, but um, it's off and just replaces with a rubber pipe, basically pushes on. So yeah, more dismantling. So this is where we're at now, I've had enough now, to be honest. That intake pipe, man, was tricky. The two bolts on there, mental. But um, yeah, it's stripped. So it's day two. Yesterday was a bit of a pain, but today, hopefully, we'll start getting some of this stuff on. I've got some hardware as well. I've got some black Jubilee clips and stuff and paint down black just to get rid of like the chrome, a bit of murdered out style. So let's uh, let's get this on then. So I'm just about to put the side parts on now. 12 weeks I waited for these mine to be done. There's no holes in them. Fix it. Fibre works, 12 weeks and I've got to drill out my own holes. Crazy. <sighs> Okay, I don't know what day we're on. I think it's day five. Well, it's New Year's Eve, so uh, Happy New Year to everybody. But um, it's done. The NGB is done. It's taken a while, to be honest, but I was obviously waiting for parts. I think it was 12 weeks, really, for uh, Fiberworks to complete. He had a few issues with it, but they, they were pretty good, to be fair. i say all in all, about four months for the stuff. Um, literally, like I said, three or four days to chuck it all on, but it has come out better than I expected, to be fair, so... Let's just have a look at it. King Japure, I got a bagaro.
ninja. Right, so basically, I just want to run through what I've done then, basically. So, um, basically, basically. So, carbon fibre. I drill all the holes out on these myself, as you've seen them here. Carbon fibre. Carbon fibre. Carbon fibre. Obviously, the Venturi carbon fibre. Carbon fibre. Carbon fibre. Carbon fibre. Obviously, then we've changed. Uh, so, we've got a Mugen. Uh, changed a lot of the hardware as well, black bolts as well. Sprayed the uh, the cover, engine cover blue as well. Uh, painted these all black as well, which were chrome before. Uh, the heat shield was done in some uh, high temp stuff as well. Changed all the Jubilee clips as well, the black ones on the even Turi. A couple on there. It's obviously little bits I can do pressing on, but you know what it's like when you want to get something done. It's been waiting ages. And just some little hardware bits like you know them them for all in all yeah well happy with it so uh yeah what's next i have no idea but uh thanks for watching everyone happy new year bye bye